actually system uses the condition tables for the uh, slotting operations. Uh, we need to set up a frame for the, uh, the uh, for the, the decisions actually, and as we know, we are doing it uh, via the uh, condition tables in G GS uh, MC screen. We can see our uh, slotting condition maintenance table. Let's run it and analyze a little bit. Let's filter it according to our warehouse. Now, uh, as we can see in the screen, uh, we can uh, separate the, our uh, materials or material filters as hand, uh, handle with care or transport in upright position. By the way, this is only a uh, sample demo uh, which we have prepared for you. Uh, let's say you have some goods uh, which need, which need to be uh, care. Uh, actually, which need to be handled with care, uh, and you can define or we, actually we, we are defining them to the, this condition table and we can say the system that if uh, our uh, warehouse handling types are 001 let's say handle with care you should propose us this put away control indicator actually and let's say we have another type of uh, handling type let's say transport in upright position we are saying to system that you need to propose uh, us the second type of uh, put away control indicator actually we can actually uh, arrange this uh, condition table uh, in very flexible way we can also create our own condition table in Z uh, frame actually and we can um, set up our whole processes uh, thanks to this condition uh, tables however let me show you the application of the slotting firstly uh, we need to check actually this is uh, m81 screen which is uh, product master data uh, screen in the ewm actually here you can see at that uh, this material don't have any put away control indicator right now but uh, we have planned put away control indicator at uh, this time because we uh, we processed the uh, slotting operations for the testing, of course. Uh, but uh, as you can see, the put away control field is empty right now. And we are expecting that after the slotting, uh, system will uh, fill this uh, field according to our uh, desired and most uh, suitable uh, put away control uh, indicator, actually. That's how uh, we can, or system can, system automatically can uh, produce or create the warehouse tasks actually. And we have another uh, field here in slotting session. Uh, you can see uh, as we, as I have talked about, as I have mentioned about, uh, we can, we need to define some data actually. Uh, system can uh, take this uh, type of data, uh, data such as volume, uh, sizes, and etc., or the uh, demand quantity, or we can just uh, give the system manually. Actually, if you would like to uh, say to the system that uh, I am consuming this uh, material, let's say one million uh, pieces per uh, week. Uh, we can just define here and after the defining system uh, takes account this information during the calculations and 
according to these calculations the system propose us will propose us a proper storage bin actually so let's run our slotting uh, processes <clears throat> here we can actually give our materials which we want to execute the slotting process and our warehouse number and party entitled to this position and if we need to analyze these fields actually as i have mentioned about uh, we don't have to use every uh, analysis in this screen we actually want to see uh, which put away control indicator system will propose us actually and i am also uh, deleting this thing and uh, according to according to our uh, expectation system will propose as a proper put away control indicator however if i uh, if i so sorry about that if i uh, would choose the let's say stock removal control indicator system then can uh, propose as a stock control uh, stock removal control indicator so on so forth and uh, here is the save mode uh, don't do not save mode and save and activation mode uh, we need to actually we don't need to but uh, in our demos scenario we are uh, selecting the result and activate code button actually and i will talk about this uh, about this later now we can just run now here uh, we can see that we have two type uh, of material which we have defined of course now the uh, system says us uh, we can do the uh, slotting uh, we can do the slotting operation for these two material actually and let's run it and see what it say it will say so system uh, made some calculations and as we have select let me find it yeah there as we have uh, as we expected system uh, propose us uh, put away control indicators you can see and uh, read uh, on the screen for the material uh, ew01 system uh, is recommending us pst1 put away control indicator and the second one actually is the pst2 uh, however uh, if we if we like to continue and activate it and after that let's write yeah it is oh it is already activated and let's reopen this screen and see if is updated or not So as you can see, it is directly updated. And after that, the system uh, will use the uh, this put away control indicator actually. 